Potholes are caused by the expansion and contraction of groundwater that has entered into the ground underneath the pavement of the roadway. When water freezes, it expands. And when it expands, it takes up more space underneath the pavement. And the pavement in itself will expand, bend, and crack, which weakens the material of the pavement. Then, when the ice melts, the pavement contracts and leaves gaps or voids in the surface under the pavement, where water can get in again and be trapped. If the water freezes and thaws over and over, the pavement will weaken and continue cracking. As the weight of cars and trucks pass over the weak spot in the road, pieces of the roadway material weaken more, which will cause the material to be displaced or broken down from the weight, creating the pothole. What happens when salt or other chemicals are brought into the picture? Well, water will freeze at 32 degrees Fahrenheit. However, in order to keep roadways from freezing, chemicals are added that will lower the temperature that water will freeze at. This creates an artificial freeze-thaw cycle that permits more occurrences of damage. Even in Louisiana, we can get a few freezes each year, and this is enough to create potholes. However, even if it does not freeze, water can still pose a major problem for roads. The water is soaked up by the mixture of rock, gravel, and sand that supports the road, the road foundation. Vehicles passing over the road can force water through the soggy roadbed, eventually eroding parts of it. As the roadbed begins to erode, asphalt sinks and eventually cracks under the continued impact of vehicles. Once these potholes form and chunks and pieces come loose, the holes can be patched with cold or hot mix material. Even though these potholes are patched, that does not stop the process of water that will return again and again and again and continue to create potholes. DOTD will continue to fix potholes where they appear. It is important to realize that Louisiana receives a great deal of rain on an annual basis, and that rain will continue its process of damaging our roads. Thanks for watching, and remember you can find out more information on the DOTD YouTube page, follow us on social media, and also visit dotd.la.gov.